Lamberti. Out to the left it goes. He is through here. There's the... That's it. Halo halo guys, kembali bersama saya Terkosio. Pada konten kali ini saya akan review salah satu uh, kartu ter super langka dari Bang Dodo yaitu POTW Bang Dodo yang mana uh, selama kualifikasi Piala Euro Bang Dodo bermain cukup gemilang, sangat gemilang sih di dua laga terakhir bersama Portugal ini dia dengan gaya main pemburu gol super langka kartu super langka ini ya kekuatan tendangannya 92 melompatnya 90 wih gila ini kalian harus dapat kartu super langka dari Bang Dodo oke selain itu kita dapat tadi dapat Dani Olmo, The Rise dan The Words oke langsung saja untuk gameplay dari Bang Dodo simak video berikut ini Well, good evening wherever you are on this most pleasant evening. It has built nicely in these idyllic conditions, conditions which are certainly playing their part in creating a glorious ambience. It's quite a struggle to get in here, points of access hard to come by and an awful lot of people gathering to get through the gates, but regardless of that, there's a great feel here and much excitement for the game ahead. Is a venue this which simply adds to the spectacle of the game it stages one of the most impressive arenas in this part of the world things have got underway here pretty promptly well I'm not quite sure he needed to hold up play quite as much as he did then a couple of his teammates were very annoyed now it's Martinez Martinez has cut it out. Yet another to add to football's endless list of could haves and should haves. Ah, quality deserted them when they really needed it. Now it's Messi. And it's Messi. Pass is coming off in quick succession here. Well, the counter could be on here. Played out to the left flank. Now it's Kostic. Gets away from his opponents. Climbs up big. It's goal really efficiently done. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Past that, sloppy. There really wasn't very much in that, not far away from being a telling final ball. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Well time, excellent interception. A nice little ball through. Ooh, perfectly measured that. And Martinez! Rice. Messi. Out to the left it goes. He is through here. There's the massive leap. Sticks it away. And they're at it again in double quick time. And a ghost-like arrival to get his head to the ball. So that's two now without reply. Well, at one nil, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way, and that losing feeling the other. And it's Neymar. 
Referee has just said there play will be on. One minute at a time. Daddy Olmo. Messi. Referee brings the first half to a close. How's the first half compared with your expectation? Well, it's field number five. Lorenzo so off we go Messi. once more. Number 18, Messi. Good spot. Lorenzo He's seen the run. Can he latch on to this? Number nine. Good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect evening for Everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good contingent of visiting fans by the look of it too. The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. His instinct for doing this is incredible. Messi at his razor-sharp best there. Well, I admire players who do that because they just don't give up on anything. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Son Hyung Min is offering an apologetic gesture of sorts. Yeah, the idea was right. The delivery could be taken. There's the shot! He's off the mark. Little matter. I think that defence there thought they were in good position and they had him where they wanted, yet somehow he's worked the scoring position when it didn't seem on. It's really crafty business, that. So that's two now without reply. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. Well intercepted and it certainly needed to be. Tries to get it clear. And it's Lampard. And he's had a hit! Oh, just like that kind of thing is not going to get them back into this game. Daddy Olmo. He's found a way through. Massive leap. Son Hyung Min. Well seen. Saw that coming. Cristiano Ronaldo. Dani Olmo gets it back. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. And here's the chance to counter. Joao Felix. He acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Well, that's down to a simple miscalculation. No more, no less. It's a pretty loose pass. And it's Lampard. Son Hyung Min. and they're quick to get it back and Danny Olmo over to the left now it's Kostic Beglin. Yeah, it's simply tragic defending when a, a renowned finisher is ignored. It's how he built his reputation. Only three minutes at a time. So, just a consolation. In with a header! That's a fine! 
fine save. Cristiano Ronaldo, he just wasn't expecting it. And this could be the final action of the first half. That a foul? Yes, the referee's given it. Yellow or red in the offence, but none over its repercussions. They'll have to see out the rest of the game with ten men. While well, sometimes a loose foul can trigger a completely different... It's the whistle for half-time. Well, it's hard to say whether a two-goal advantage under these circumstances...